I don't want any more of this jail stuff. I'm almost done. I have four and a half years in. I want six year a bit. And uh, I feel that, uh, that I paid for what I did. But I've come a long ways to come here. And uh, it's, it's great. I, you know, I wouldn't do it again, but to meet up with these horses, oh, it's great. They're all my friends now, they listen to me. Other people don't listen to me. <laughs> I was married. I was with my ex-wife for 10 to 13 years. I had two sons. I had life going for me. And then I got laid off. My wife and I split up, and then that's when I just started doing, you know, running around, you know, using drugs and just robbing, cheating, stealing, doing what I had to do to get by because I wasn't working. And now it makes me realize I wasn't right what I've done. And now it's the time to get back to my old self. Second Chances is created by Thoroughbred Retirement Foundation, and they were looking for a way to rescue the racehorses that get injured. So to save them from either being abused, neglected, or possibly even slaughtered. They had the vision and the mission, but they needed a place to put them. Where do you find farms to put them? And all of a sudden they thought about a correctional institution. They were driving by and they said, there's all the land. This is, would be perfect and we can teach inmates how to take care of horses. So today we're going to review colic. Why would we want to review Then we college? seek to find them jobs yeah, afterwards yeah. because they have this great yeah. skill. So it was yeah. a win-win situation. Number one killer exactly. Yeah. Number one killer When we horses. graduate, we get a Everything completion is. certificate yeah. and then we get a yeah. certification for the elite groomers program, which a lot of people don't have that, and that gives us a better opportunity to find work. So is colic a disease or a symptom? You know, I know how to build houses and all, but I ain't got nothing on paper. So I really would like to have something on paper my mom be proud of me, my daughter be proud of me. All I got to pay for is uh, court papers, really. <laughs> to watch a man come out, and when he first gets off the van, and he's greeted by my dogs, and they're like, oh my gosh, I haven't seen a dog in years. And you just watch them, it's almost like all the walls break down. And one groom said it best when he said, you know, we all have kindness inside of us, but you kind of forget, given the situation that they grew up in or that they ended up in, and you somehow forget that you have that kindness until you come out here. Oops, oh, so it's okay, girl. It's okay, girl. And then every day you go, oh, there it is. And then it grows and you get more kind. And as with anything, after you do it for so long, it becomes a habit. And that's how they get changed and that's how they change inside. It's kind of a self-awareness that only a horse can give a man.